hey what's up guys welcome back to my channel i'm tia j y'all go ahead and hit that like button y'all i deserve a like for this i'm about to let you know how i find my unmarked hidden clearance deals let's get into it okay so the first thing i use is my memory and my good old two eyes now this right here is is out of place for one and two i remember that it was clearance at another store so my first mind is going to tell me hey my first thought is going to tell me, hey, scan this. See if it's clearance at this store. Y'all always look really, really high. And like stuff like this is one of something or dusty or anything like that. Y'all always scan that kind of stuff. Now, you're going to need to download the Walmart app, which I'll link it on the screen. And I'll link the steps on the screen as well. That way you will know. Um, because I think it's a shop. I'll just have to link it on the screen. Um once i start editing every, and everything that way you know what uh app to use and how to do it okay so we're on the clearance aisle and y'all you always want to scan 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 on the clearance aisle um use your memory of the things that's been here forever this store i'm gonna be honest with you is not a really good store that marks down things really really fast um, however, I do find good stuff here. Any kind of seasonal stuff, whether it's, if it's out of season, like Thanksgiving, whether it's marked or not, you want to scan it. Christmas stuff, um, Halloween, like I said, Thanksgiving, Black Friday stuff is starting to drop right now and it's not even marked. That's the thing. Okay, so let me just find a few things um, that is hidden clearance and I'm going to take you guys to the scanner. That way you can see what I'm talking about. Okay, before we go to the scanner, like these um, kind of stickers like this, most of the time you don't you don't even have to scan it because those are just the prices as is, um, and they marked out the barcode. So that kind of stuff, don't even worry about that. And before we go to the scanner, let me go ahead and do a like a little quick tutorial on Brixie. Okay, guys, so this is this is gonna be really quick. Um, this is another thing I use. It's Brickseek.com. And this is something I use. It's like a guide for me because a lot of times the stuff is not there. But I did find, like I said, a $700 TV for $89 Samsung. I mean, had the work smart TV, all that good stuff. And I found it on Brickseek and it was $89. So I was really happy about that. Um, you see where it says 10 cent Barbies. I doubt if this is, you know, in my store. Um, a lot of people say take it with a grain of salt, but I've found some pretty awesome things on Brickseed. Now, it is not 100% guaranteed. So, if you find something, say you click on this little Lego Creator Santa uh, poly bag set for $0.50. Cent, you're like, oh, this is a good, great stocking stuffer. I want to see if I can find it. You go in a store and you're looking everywhere. And it's just not there. You looking all by the Legos, you know, all in the right spots. Sometimes you can look on the clearance aisle and it's just right there. And it's just not marked down to 50 cent yet. But sometimes, y'all, it's just not there. It's old stuff. Um, a lot of things I see on Brickseek is old. It's stuff I already got, you know, um, I already have, I already purchased it. But I purchased it, um, a different amount so say for instance i see something for just like this right here this um swag board hoverboard 25 i found one for i think it was the 39 if i'm not mistaken it was the 39 now they're 25 9 out of 10 it's probably not even there so bargain shopping takes a lot clearance shopping unmarked shopping hidden clearance glitch shopping whatever you want to call it takes time you know don't think you're gonna get on brick seat yeah some stuff might be just bam right there in your face but don't think you're gonna get on here and everything is listed and you're gonna be like oh i'm, I'm going to get that oh i'm going to get that like a sales ad it, it's just not like that okay so let's get on back with the video okay so we're at the scanner and this is the little scanner and a lot of a lot of walmart locations are taking them out i don't know why um but it's really really helpful so i found these few things on the clearance aisle of course i'm gonna get these little sock things but this is 11 dollars. it was nine nineteen eighty eight. 
and I'm going to go ahead and scan it. First, I'm going to scan the yellow sticker. And look at that. It's $5. So you don't know how much it really is, you know, but I'm going to scan the white uh, white one too. You don't know how much it really is and it still came up $5 unless you scan it. You don't know how much it really is unless you scan it. Um, it might be something that you're like, okay, I'll pay like 5 bucks for it. But I don't want to pay 11 but you'll never know unless you scan it. Here's something else, y'all. This is just some simple things I found. Um, $7. Okay? So it's not 10 It was 12 something Then they marked it down to 10 It's marked 10 but it's actually 7 So I'm just going to scan these anyway just to show you that, hey, sometimes you win some, you lose some. Okay? So you always just want to scan everything. So this is how I pretty much get my clearance. You know, my memory, my eyes. Uh, I use the Walmart app to scan, which I showed you in the beginning of the video. And we're going to go over here to the clothes because I get a lot of clothes that's really, really cheap. Okay, so... Y'all know I can see a clearance sign from a mile away. So I do see this $5, but I never take, I just don't, I don't trust it. I don't take their word for it. When they say $5, I still scan, you know, like this right here, it says three. I still scan it, you know, especially if it's something that I'm interested in. And let's see here. Okay, so I end up finding this one. 7.87. I actually scanned it. I'm not going to take this one to the scanner. I'm just going to link on the screen that y'all is only two dollars. So it wasn't. It's not five. It's not 7.87. It's not five. It's two dollars. So I'm actually going to pick it up because I, I didn't want to pay five for it, but I'll pay two. So I'm going to get that, and then even weird stuff I scan because like right here. This is a Christmas sweat, uh, shirt. Even though I know it's Christmas, it probably is not clearance. But I'll scan it anyway just to see because you never know. You know, you never know. Clearance shopping is not easy. I make it look easy because I edit out a lot of walking. <laughs> $3 here. I did scan a few things no look uh, most of the stuff is actually higher <laughs> than three dollars on this cart because people will put things anywhere that's just how it go so i'm going to link a few things on the screen and i want y'all to scan them i'm not going to say anything i'm just going to let y'all scan them so you can see how it is let me know in the comments if it is cheap at your store this has been here a while Okay, y'all. So, this is just how I do everything. Um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you get a better understanding. Until next time, guys. Peace out.